Hello guys, it's Chris here and welcome to the seventh episode of Neymar's Road to the World Cup. I really need to get this series out more consistently. 43,000 of you guys now, probably going to be out quite a bit more than that when this video is out, but you're all asking for this series at the moment. It's going really well, hopefully I can keep bringing out these episodes a bit more regularly. I mean, gone are the days of my budget builders on 1,500 subscribers when I uploaded once every six weeks because someone sarcastically commented that they wanted wanted to see another one of my videos but we've come a long way since then guys this is the team at the moment and here we are for another epic episode of a series that bears no resemblance to Neymar's journey to to Rio in 2014 it's just me playing a couple of games really that's all it is but shush so Felipe Melo was our last addition into the team another note guys I told you in one of my last videos that I was trying to get a wager of Rotashore you could have a Channel Island rivalry sort of game and um, he responded to me and I fanboyed a bit there's there's I've only had two claims to fame played KSI on Virgin Gaming once but he didn't know that beat him 5-2 went past his keeper and reboned it into the net for one of my goals and he rage quit so there's something to bring up when I'm when I'm a bigger YouTuber than him, you know. So Harry has agreed to do a wager with me at some point in the future, which would be absolutely insane for my channel. We have this thing called the Marathi in Jersey, which is when Jersey plays Guernsey in like a football match. So we could do the FIFA version of that, and that would be pretty cool. You know, the word "cool" is is thrown around a lot these days. It's a game of FIFA between two nerds on the internet. You, shut up so yeah if that happens that game would be absolutely insane i was thinking about the preparation i'd have to do you know playing clips of a barbo and david louise over in my mind again and again just to you've got to be sweaty not just play sweaty from what i've seen harry doesn't look like a very good fifa player so you know we'll see but get some practice and do some serious training now i can't keep going along with this guys i've actually been pulling your leg what I've said then is complete lie. Sorry, I just I just got a bit excited and I don't like lying, but of course I'm not going to train to play Harry. Have you seen his FIFA ability? Why can't I record one video without being a twat? Obviously, there's just a correlation with being handsome. So this is a team. Let's get on to this episode and play a game. And if you guys are looking to buy some FIFA coins, make sure to check out buycheapfifacoins.com. Very cheap prices, reliable site, make sure to go check them out. Also guys, which club crest do you think I should play on this account with? I mean, I usually go for the Colchester United one, but I want a bit of a change. So maybe there's one that looks slightly like the Brazil national team's crest or or what? I don't know. You guys put in the comments below any crest you'd like me to use. Sorry to any Walsall fans out there, but you know, it's it's kind of tr you're probably not the large majority of my your subscribers are you but look at this guys i cannot pause as i don't have ball possession yet it's my corner well done ea sports and we got a penalty i'm not entirely sure what this guy's trying to do but it looks like he's just trying to make me win oh my god i missed it not a good penalty that yeah i'm not sure what's happening in this game this guy doesn't seem to be trying what okay five minutes into that game he let me score and then rage quit i don't know but we've won another game so that's not going to count in this episode oh my goodness why have i come up against this disgusting display of players mate Oh, get out of the way. Finish that. Oh my goodness. That is a beautiful goal. Compilation goal. Come on. Only thing that I shouldn't have done two roulettes in a row. It doesn't quite look. But the Hocus Pocus makes it look lovely. Look at that finish. Nice. Oh, to eight. So much. Who did that even hit? I, that seems to have collided about 157 people on the way to that. Oh no, that did not go where I was aiming. Bang! Oh, good finish, Neymar. Not a compilation goal, but it's not too bad. Get in. Oh, we've actually scored. He brought his keeper out. I had no idea. What a goal. That's probably the furthest goal I've scored in FIFA 14, actually. Uh, okay, and we've had our second rage quit of the day. Okay, so that means we can buy a player up to a price range of 50k. Yeah, 50k and with 5-star skills. 
Okay guys, so what I've actually decided to do, seeing as we got that compilation goal, I didn't want to waste that, so I've bought someone with 5 star skills, not that expensive, but pretty much the same players, Mike on the 8 8, Bernard, 5 star skills, 4 star weak foot, quality winger, he's very quick, got a decent shot on him as well, so that will really increase the quality of our wing play hopefully. Actually this time I'm going to swap Elton and Bernard, because... Elton can cut in on his left foot then. Bernard can do exactly the same. So let's try that and move on to the next game. Pretty good looking team. Wow. D I, I don't deserve that. That wasn't even a skill goal. I tried to do a hocus pocus at the end there and he just bulldozed through him even though he's about four foot two. But how has he got through? <laughs> Is that like... <laughs> Press A you stupid lard mountain. Oh, that was actually quite nice. I was trying to do a hocus pocus for the last 10 minutes, but you know. Oh, go on, finish that. Oh my goodness, what a goal! That was seriously nice. That is a definite compilation goal. Wow, Jobson. I sometimes surprise even myself with my own FIFA ability. That was sick. Well guys, after some thinking, I have actually decided to go out and buy Danny Alves. Um, cost me about 35k, so quite a costly player really, but you know, definitely worth it. He's got some insane stats, to quickly show you his card, obviously. An insane player. Right, my camera just ran out of battery, so I've got to be quite quick. But yeah, this is the team. Thank you for watching, guys. That's going to be today's episode. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I need to get to bed because I've got a semi-final game to get. Basically, if we win this, we play at a half-decent ground at a cup final, you know. One that doesn't actually have molehills. Like, seriously, we had to get a shovel at the start of our game at the weekend and take some molehills off the pitch. Like, the left flank was unplayable. That's the, the standard. It's not high. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and I shall see you later.